Hello, Doug Trevino, Realtor with Maxim Realtors here in Southwest Florida. Hey folks, listen, I just wanted to take a quick minute and shoot an update here on uh, something that was announced on Tuesday on the 5th of April um, by Florida Housing. This was the Hardest Hit Fund Program. Uh, this program was to take effect on April 18th, on Monday, April 18th at 9 a.m. Um, what is the Hardest Hit Fund Program? Actually, a pretty neat band-aid. Uh, that the state of Florida just released. Um, Hardest Hit Fund Program is essentially going to provide funding uh, for Flor Florida homeowners who have A, fallen behind on their mortgage payment because of job loss, unemployment, or B, catch them up okay, on their um, past due on their mortgages. Um, it's going to do this in a couple of different ways. The Hardest Hit Fund Program consists of two sub-programs. Um, the first program is the Unemployment Mortgage Assistant Program, uh, the UMAP, and this program is going to provide up to $12,000 okay, to go toward mortgage payments and or escrowed mortgage related payments. All right, and This is supposed to provide this coverage for up to six months or until the homeowner can start making their mortgage payments once more. Okay? However, again, a cap of $12,000. The second program is the MLRP, or the Mortgage Loan Reinstatement Payment Program. Um, this program is going to provide up to $6,000, and the $6,000 is going to go toward bringing your first mortgage current. Okay, So once that's, that's what that's there for. Also, you need to prove that you are going to be able to start making that mortgage payment once more, though. Okay, So there's a caveat to this, to this uh, program. Um, what is this supposed to do? Well, they're predicting that they're going to be able to help upwards of 40,000 uh, Florida homeowners, twice as many as they first initially expected. So that's good news. Um, how is this going to be uh, panning out come the 18th? Once people, That's left to be seen. Um, there have been a couple of other programs here in the past um, where people have applied, applied, applied and not gotten approved. So it'll be interesting to see how this pans out uh, come April 18th and moving on from there. Um, definitely a band-aid situation, not a permanent fix. Uh, there are going to be minimum guidelines of qualification and both are going to be the same for both of the, uh, the sub-programs that I mentioned. Okay, um, Down below, right below this video, is going to be a link to the actual site All right, and also some additional information. They are warning that there are going to be some copycat sites, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So please go below here. Use this as the actual site. So click on there um, and uh, go there directly. I'll also include a site for Florida Housing as well. Uh, they have additional links and information there. That's pretty useful. Um, so Florida is pretty happy and excited about this. Let's see what happens. Um, a lot of a lot of things here. Again, a, a temporary solution for those folks who know they're going to be working again eventually or coming up soon and will be able to make that payment again, great plan. Okay, This is great assistance. For those folks who have fallen so far behind, they don't have any hopes of getting near the job that they had before or the income that they had before, um, they're looking at foreclosure down the road. Should we be talking short sale? I don't know, but call 239-410-4460. Let's discuss and see what makes sense for you. However, this program is available for those folks. Um, I think it's a good initiative by the state of Florida. Let's see what happens. Always keep a positive mind. Uh, any questions, absolutely feel free to comment below. Please do subscribe uh, to be kept up to date and posted. More information. And uh, hope you're having a fantastic day.